Alrighty. Is it still there? Get away. Music's not playing anymore. Thank you. Bye bye. Anyway, welcome back everybody to some more Quantum Break. Welcome to the blindness, starring your boy. Been uh it's been an eventful weekend. But that'll be uh well, if you follow me on Twitter, you know one of the things that happened. But then there's another thing that happened personally that I don't really want to go into, but that's not what this stream is about. This stream is about time and how it's dying and breaking and gonna eventually freeze and we're the only one that can stop it. Because of course we are. Anyway, let's continue. I'm gonna have some of my drink. Security was tight at the Monarch Gala. You took quite a risk walking into the lion's den. If we were gonna kidnap Dr. Amaral, then we needed to do it from the inside. Beth Wilder. You were quick to trust her. We had common interests. Is that all you had? That's all we needed. Thanks for showing up. Here, I thought this was gonna be a rescue. Right, there's a story here. You know a guy called Hatch? Serene's right-hand man. He was here. He gave me this big speech about how he wants to take down Paul. I hope you said no. I didn't trust him for a second. He set me loose anyways, told me to wait for an opening. I just gave you one. Appreciate it. All right. What's it look like out there? I think you're secure. Everyone's concentrating on the party. So far, your crazy plan's working. And Dr. Emerald? I don't have a fix on her. She's either at the party or at her office at the R&D facility here on the island. I'll scout out the party. So you're gonna sip champagne while I break into a high security installation? It's like you got this all figured out. I'll save you a cocktail, weenie. Oh, well, in that case. My cover isn't gonna survive the night, but it'll last a little longer, so you can't walk out the front door with me. This is the quickest way to the R&D facility. I disabled the security at the back door, but there'll be guards. Contact me when you're clear. And Jack, you know what's at stake here. This can't be about revenge. I'm not here for Paul. Man, I'm just looking at these two, like, I've got such a kind of back and she is, like, so stiff. Good luck. Hey! He's escaping! Well, that was fast. I'm Rush! Oh, so I do have a sprint. I forgot all about that. Oh, that has got to hurt your hand. Just literally punching the helmet. At least it looked like you punched the helmet. Damn. That will hurt in the morning. I not? Oh, I apparently already have it. Growing. I was learning to control them better. That felt good. Oh. One's right there. I'm an idiot. Okay, well... Who the hell designs these doors? Okay, I'm gonna have to move faster to get through. Gotta go fast! This is a good question. Like, who makes a door like that? Is this freaking Greybeards? Very sci-fi and very monarch. Something tells me it wasn't commissioned by them, though. Yeah, it doesn't seem their style. I still question, how do I have my guns? Hey, Beth, I'm clear. What's next? You'll see a radar tower up ahead soon. Let me know when you get inside. All right. 
That looks like a turret. Okay, okay, okay. I don't have any more sprinting ability. Um, okay, okay, okay. You could have warned me about that one, Beth. Yo, got a... Got myself an LMG? I don't remember this weapon. That's probably not a good sign. I probably shouldn't be using it. Up you go. Exactly work out. Let's try this again. All right. Okay, that that confused the heck out of me. Man, the dry dock's off turned into a disaster. It's gonna take him weeks to clean it up. It was all supposed to be quietly swept under the carpet, but now we've got a shitload more bodies to disappear. Well, at least we got it under control now. Wow, okay, this thing hits. Time felt broken here. My goodness. Have I just been like not using the best freaking weapon in the game. The timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. I've been thinking. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral... You'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutterproof gear. I bet Dr. Amaral would have that in her office, too. I'll keep an eye out. See if I can grab it for you. Looking. I can't believe that Joyce guy just gave himself up like that. That's Seven? crazy. Roughly. Yeah, well... Probably more on that chopper. Is it true he's got some kind of powers? I mean, without the gear. Yeah, it's true. Are you are you talking smack about Lance Reddick? Oh, I don't know which one of you it was. You're gonna die. Okay, there are snipers. I'm getting flashbacks. Okay. I immediately just got gun green flashbacks. I'm like, sniper! Dry dock's off turned into a disaster. It's gonna take him weeks to clean it up. It was all supposed to be quietly swept under the carpet. Okay, yeah, if I can hit headshots with this thing, then this is nice. I need to make sure I actually hit the headshots, though. The timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. I've been thinking. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral... He'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Specialist troopers have the stutterproof. Okay, all right. That that is that is a two tap. The dry dock's off turned into a disaster. It's gonna take them weeks to clean it up. It was all supposed to be quiet. Still always end up using three bullets. 
timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Yeah, yeah, loose cannon. Place to aim the cannon, guys. I've been thinking. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral, he'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutterproof gear. I bet Dr. Amaral would have that in her office too. I'll keep an eye out. Well, see if I grab it for you. I'm gonna take this nice and slow. Wow, you are so alive. I'm not gonna lie, I'm impressed. Yeah, this thing kicks them down. <laughs> okay, so this is definitely the use on heavy armor dudes. Thanks, Beth. Although I'm curious if I can actually grab a sniper rifle. I think there is a sniper rifle option, but it's more like a like a DMR. If I remember correctly, it's been a bit. Carbine. Okay. Next stop, the radar tower. Great. Another one. It's a real shame. I really wish I could have the this carbine and the light machine gun because holy cow that is like a that would th that would be broken that would be such a broken combo maybe i don't know i feel like i remember the carbine being pretty decent let's find out though Although, it looks like we're about to get more into a close-range fight. This would have more ammo. Okay, how much can I have access of? No, that fills, fills up at 60. Let's see how well this works. We'll learn from my mistakes. Beth? I'm at the radar tower. Where's the lab? Below your feet. It's all top secret. The elevator inside will take you down. Oh, seriously? What is this, a Bond villain lair? You have no idea. Just don't fall into the shark tank. Fuck. Good evening, folks. This is your pal, Bobby Redford. And you better believe, I'm still hopping mad about what went down at the university last night. Anybody else think it's kind of weird that the radio works fine? So let me take another approach. You know how Monarch took over the old dry docks, what, five, six years back? Just put it all up and set up 
some kind of an industrial operation there or something? Well, it turns out they had a freak accident there this morning. One of those unfinished ships came crashing down. You probably heard all about it. It was pretty spectacular. You'd think there'd be some kind of explanation for what had to be a multi-million dollar disaster. But guess which multinational corporation has no comment on that little event either? Now, I don't know about you folks, but it seems to me all of a sudden there's a lot of weird stuff going down and Monarch's name just keeps coming up. So what's Monarch doing about it? It's business as usual for them. In fact, they're throwing a party at their fancy mansion on Gold Island. From what I hear, it's going to be a hell of a bash, but of course it's off limits to anybody who isn't a part of their clique. God, it seems to me these guys bought out Riverport, and now they're getting drunk while the city burns. But I'm sure they've got our best interests in mind, huh? Yeah, no, that's really weird that the radio works fine while... Oh, I guess it wasn't. I guess it was just a split second thing. That's weird. Never mind. I don't remember there being like an interact thing with this helicopter. I guess not. Misremembering. Okay, well, if that's the case, then there's gotta be something down here, right? Probably like a upgrade or something it was probably down here. I don't know why I'm still acting like, oh man, I gotta find collectibles. I don't. <laughs> I literally have everything. We do so accepting great responsibility. I present to you the CFR, the Cronon Field Regulator. This device has been at the heart of our Cronon research since 2010, but I am here to assure you that it is so much more than just that. This device will be our salvation, and as promised, it is ready. To some of you, this means nothing. To others, everything. Rest assured, you will all know when the time is right. We are entering a volatile age. Great danger is coming our way. It cannot be prevented, but we can be protected. And so tonight is a celebration. A celebration in the face of darkness. We celebrate, but for some of you, this means nothing. For others, everything. Rest assured, you will all know when the time is right. We are entering a volatile age. Great danger is coming our way. It cannot be prevented, but we can be protected. And so tonight is a celebration, a celebration in face of darkness. Tonight we celebrate because I promise to you that we are prepared. We are prepared for what comes next. We are prepared to do what is necessary. We are prepared to survive. Thank you. Speech is streaming. Let's give Monarch the audience they deserve. Beth, I'm about to take the yeah, upload the VOD. See Paul still fond of his own voice. Yeah, he's talking about his survival plan. Crowd's eating it up. We're gonna upload the VOD. They're gonna know the truth. You can't hide from this, Paul. You're gonna get cancelled on Twitter. heck out of here this thing is a safety hazard um is that how you hold a pistol i don't think it is doc 
Dr. Amaral's office. Looks like that's one level up. Right. Uh, I was about to say four, it's eleven. Is that? Is there not a you are here? So I can't see it. Alright, well, let's get moving. startled me. Are you sure this sure can't be traced back to us? Impossible. Impossible. I've adjusted I've the adjusted flight the controls, controls so the drone will crash into the villa on your order. Good. Very, very good. I'll make sure, I'll make sure that sure Sophia's in position when the time is right. right. Wait for my call. My call. Oh. Lance, what are you doing? It was some kind of surveillance drone. Knowing that Monarch had eyes in the sky made me a little uneasy. Lance, what are you planning? Dampeners. The device drained my powers. We refer to it as a chronon dampener. And well, it dampened my spirits, so. Very accurate name. ordered Hatch to kill me because he didn't want to put his plan at risk. But seeing the scale of that facility, I started realizing just how deep that plan went. It made me wonder. Time was ending. What was it all for? Weird. I don't know why it auto- I guess it's because I was in combat, maybe there's like an auto-switch in combat, but that was weird. I did not switch my gun. The chart showed that all of Monarch's major technological advancements started in 2010. Around the same time that something else happened. Ground Zero. Oh, nothing in here. Alright, be on your way. Do a little, little dive right there. Wait, is that the way to go? Oh, there are enemies. Okay, okay. Where did the third guy go? Third dude. Where the heck did he go? Am I stupid? Was is there not three people? Oh no, they're putting the they're putting the stuff on a big dude. Bitch. 
juggernaut. Oh man. Again, not exactly holding that pistol correctly. Can't get over that. Sprinting, basically, my sprinting to recharge. Well, this guy is a real pain in the butt. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. That instant killed me. All right. The device drained my powers. We refer to it as a chronon damp. Serene ordered Hatch to kill me because he didn't want to put his plan at risk. And seeing the scale of that facility, I started realizing just how deep that plan went. Maybe wonder. Time was ending. What was it all for? This dude is like... <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny to me. The chart showed that all of Monarch's major technological advancements started in 2010. Around the same time that something else happened. Ground Zero. All right, here we go, attempt number two. Man, that is such a bright screen, it's almost not even worth uh, skipping. Okay, with this load time, yeah, maybe skipping is not a good idea. I think I froze my game. Give it another 10 seconds. Okay, yeah, it's not. All right, well, <laughs> great. Okay, good to know. Don't skip the cutscenes. Apparently, that is a big no no. Remedy's like, you will look at the story. Sam Lake over here just pointing a gun in my head being like, no, you will watch your mistakes. Okay, well. Okay, well, at least I got a checkpoint here this time for some reason. I don't understand. Oh, 
Okay, so maybe I need like a shotgun or something because the, the carbine is not too great. What a surprise, a sniper rifle in close quarters combat is not a good idea. What the fuck? Oh no, I, I was hoping for... Okay, well... What the fuck is that? I like skipped the cutscene to end up getting the same dialogue anyway. Okay, uh, where are all my powers? Did I get hit with like the dampening grenade or something? Definitely a shotgun is the better choice here. Okay. That is way too close! Alright, well, this is definitely going better technically. I feel like I have been a lot further away from death than before. Oh, okay, that's it. That's funny. Like the the barriers come back, even though they can actually instant kill you. <laughs> oh jeez, that ragdoll. Man, my aim could not be worse. Okay, yep. Definitely gonna need to keep the shotgun. It was clear that Monarch had been building the Chronon technology for years. They were prepared for the fracture. None of it would have been possible without the CFR. Which way is Amon's office? Other things I can pick up doesn't look like it. These things were designed by walking tanks. They weren't for you. Don't flatter yourself. game whatever you say and this has been an interesting experience today I'm guessing this isn't the usual employee route okay what is happening this game is freaking busted for some reason on this act the 
Dr. Amaral's office must be close. Why did I get her? No alarms. Looks like nobody here knows about the mess I made on the way in. Nice job, Beth. I'm gonna make it worse. Oh, it's all going back. Oh man. Is that a cat? It's a cat! You kitty. these other offices real quick. Oh, there it is. There's the Alan Wake. Absolutely worth it. The doggo? It hey, doggo. Look at doggo. Ah, uh, that's just I want another kid. That doesn't matter. I want more pet pictures. Very that's lonely. Office. The Amaral had tried to warn Paul. The end of time was approaching quickly. Less than twenty four hours away. Mr. Serene believed it would take years to run its course. Admittedly, he was wrong. Any more? Nope. Looks like that's it for beach things. That there looks like what Beth wanted. Oh, shit. Emeralds at the park. Stutter won't last. I better find a way out of here and get to the party. Man, I like the the whole children of the quite elder expensive piece of tech you stole. Building. I knew Beth's cover wouldn't last long. I had to get it to her at the party before it was too late. That was funny. That was funny to me. You know, I don't think time distorting is supposed to make this kind of flickering happen. You know, usually I don't think. I don't know. Oh wait, was that something here? It is. Yo, check out that lion. He ain't even. This is sticking out set. Get prescription. Juggernaut performance review 22.7. Anniversary next Saturday. 23rd of August. Oh, Sam Lake, you made a book! Time travel and quantum physics. Yo, good on you, Sam. Oh, picture. What was that? Oh, look at the doggos. Got it. Oh, it's a roly poly cat. You. 
Cute, cute, cute. We got a child and a bunch of friends. Oh, but the child is holding a cat. Nice. Another dog. You know, I'm really happy with the diversity of dogs and cats. Way to go, Remedy. Usually it's always just one or the other. It's usually just dogs or cats, but Remedy's like, no, both. The Monarch combat gear was unwieldy. What I'd taken from Dr. Amaral's office was, uh, is much lighter. Almost like a civilian model. Oh man. New people we're gonna have to be dealing with this regularly too. Guns made to operate in a stutter. Paul had clear priorities. When time ends, guns don't. That's the American way. <laughs> Even when time is done, guns won't. Okay, gotta go up there. Anything interesting in here? <laughs> what was the question? Oh, dude. Come on, you're at work. Oh, you know what? Really, dude? Got a point. You're at work. Why are you... Why are you trying to find a relationship at work while you're in the middle of a meeting? Like, I understand priorities of, like, you know, wanting to find happiness, but, dude, come on. Man, these just look like... These just look like school chairs, but they evolved. Like, this is the second evolution of, like, school chairs for me. Like, I don't know why that is. They just... I guess it's just because they're bright freaking royal yellow looking Garage. or something. Sounds like the way to this place. Oh, well this looks like a problem in a moment. All I had to do was make it through the garage. Seems simple enough. After what he pulled, you gotta figure he's dead, right? That's... You know what? If I find another one, I'm gonna just keep the light machine gun on me as long as I can. You didn't even say it coming. I 
I can see through walls, but I still can't hit anything. Well, I'm not gonna make my life any easier. I'll take that heavy pistol out. though. Gladly. Adventures in Flesh by L. Hakula. Chapter L? 11. Is someone playing? An audio book or a radio? Finally Whoever that is, shut it off. Now. His dungeon. I think I'll just leave that right there. Somebody find out where that's coming from. This is supposed to be a secure Damn. channel. I almost have locked everything down. Maybe I can turn it off. Playing an audiobook over the radio, that's funny. And Snake pulled to Dumbledore. Oh, okay, hello. Well, you've got the gun I want. Still don't know why I can't hold a pistol correctly. Hey, pal. I needed this. Beth, I got that device for you, but Dr. Amaral's at the party. Yeah, I just spotted her. Wanna be my date? Yeah, save me that cocktail weenie. I'll make my way there. Serene's finished his speech. That is a lot person. of pizza. He's headed your way. And then that one he little box of, said. like, Chinese takeout. I'll keep him occupied, but switch to the monarch frequency to make sure you stay out of his crosshairs. Okay, I'll see you at the party. Man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna enjoy a pizza after this, that's for certain. I, like, I'm now really wanting it. I was considering, like, making maybe a burger or something. But now I'm just like, nah, I'm gonna... After seeing that, I'm making pizza. <laughs> and though, again, it's not takeout, so it's not nearly as good. better than one magazine of a really powerful gun is better than a lot of ammo for a gun that doesn't do nothing. Get round Man, that guy's like skipping around me right now. Man, could I, could you die? Holy cow, dude. Could be like the Nathan Drake of Monarch. That's the last of them. Need an ammo backpack. I'm assuming I can pick up ammo with the ammo backpack or play machine gun. I cannot. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, well, that is a... Okay, well, that's the balance then. Okay, well, it's... Since that, that's the balance, yeah, I'm gonna keep the shotgun on me. <laughs> Be telling it how it is. Okay, that was just another entrance. I need the exact coordinates for Joyce ASAP. Monarch Actual is moving in to intercept. Just spotted him entering the tunnel system outside the party grounds. <sighs> Getting uh, okay. damn. That's some good tape. What is that even tied to? Probably just like a nail in there or something. I could see the mansion where the gala was. I had to find a way to get there. Oh, that's not good. They've got a damn. I can see the energy field of another monarch chronon dam. Drain my powers. I have to find a way to shut them off. My powers will work within that sphere. I better be careful. What? Do I really have to go down there? I really do. Like, look at this. They don't care. Oh, he does now. I've already got my... Like, I, I'm already damping. I don't know what you think is gonna happen. Now I'm like, man, I could really use that carbine. But... I feel like, was I just crazy? I swear I was like hitting the other guy and like he didn't care at all. Why, why did that other guy care? Was he was closer? Focus. 
can't really dampen me. Friend. Time to move. Headed for the party. What was your plan? I needed to get to Dr. Amaral before the stutter ended and Monarch found out I was coming. How oh, long that guy was waiting for me there? It would have been too long. There's gotta be a way to get past that gate. I would assume I could just like blind, but I'm not getting a prompt in. Like the should be this, isn't it? Yeah, look at that, it's doing it. You have to be up here. No. There's no prompt for it. I mean, look at that. It's clearly telling me, okay, rewind time, but it, it's not. Oh, I'd be like right here. This is this the is only, the only tunnel, tunnel entrance, entrance Joyce could have entered through. Enter. Secure, Secure the exit. exit. I'm going in alone. Sir, sir, are you sure you don't sure want support? Want support? We've, seen We've seen what Jack, what Jack can, do. can do. I'm the only I'm one who can stop him. stop him. If he gets to the mainland, he'll lose him for good. good. Secure, Secure the exit. exit. Are you looking for me, pal? How sweet. So sweet of you to care about me like that. Is my invitation? I can't do anything, so yeah. Beth should be here somewhere. 
Need to get to her before the stutter ends. This won't this take won't long. long. Make sure Make everything sure goes smoothly smooth at the same end. You know how important this party is to us. Hope I'm not Hope overstepping, overstepping my bounds here, sir, but I don't, I don't like it. Like it. Please, Please take a couple, couple of our guys, guys with you. With you. Locked, up Locked up or not, not Joyce, Joyce is dangerous. Is dangerous. I'm touched I'm by you must guide the concern. I can, I can handle Jack Joyce. Joyce. <laughs> Cocky bastard. But he did give me a chance. I was like, Paul's got a fan. Mr. Serene's speech had been a success. The world was falling apart, but the wine and cheese crowd was enjoying their little goddamn soiree. I can't go up there. Shame. Oh. You wild, wild Beth over here. the mansion. Okay, we can make that work. I got ourselves some art right there. Got a lot of art. A lot of similar designer art. Pace. I can't open doors, apparently. We shouldn't wait. Let's go get Dr. Emma. Alright, now I can open door. Jack, get her moving before time kicks back in and that drone turns us into paste. Let's get to it. We need your expertise. No. I'm not asking. Okay. Alright, 
Taking this nice and slow. Don't wanna, don't wanna rush in here. Cause that is a good way to die. He's got no thoughts in the world, too, so. Just run right at me and towards an explosive. <laughs> simple. There's a bridge to the mainland. Fight my way through anything Mara could throw at me and steal a car. Drive it back to the swimming pool. Remember, we need your ass alive for the next part. See wow, I cannot believe I actually got that shot off. Imagine if I actually got that shot. Dude, this guy is Nathan Drake. He didn't get a good shot on at all. Alright, you know what? A little overkill, but you know what? I really need him to not.
Okay. <laughs> Didn't even bother trying. His backpack. Beth and Dr. Amor all clear. It was time for me to get gone. For that, I need wheels. I honestly still feel like there's at least that one sniper just chilling around here somewhere. And look at all these explosives. There's... Okay, time to get a ride out of here. No way, there's not at least one more person to deal with. Then again, maybe not. I don't know. Valley parking. Beloved by car thieves everywhere. Alright, I'm gonna go up here and see if I can grab that sniper ammo this dude had. What was he up there? He was probably up there. Higher elevation. <laughs> Bane of non platformers. Um, okay. Hello, chair. the end of the act I think that went by pretty well all things considered especially since I definitely didn't get any of that done beforehand like when I had tried to do a hard attempt I wonder if I just got bored I probably just like played the game so much that it was like overwhelming my amount of time of playing it I don't know but now it is our reward television Oh, right, again, forgot about that. <laughs> Hang on. Also, gonna turn the audio up because it's really quiet. Not really quiet, but quiet enough for me to have a hard time hearing. Forgot about the junction. Thing growing inside me. I've been fighting it for six hard years. Dr. Amaral was developing a cure for the Cronon syndrome. She was the only one who could administer the treatments that kept my sickness at bay. Paul? And Jack had taken her away from me. How the fuck did this happen, Morton? How is it possible they managed to take her? Paul, is your illness talking? I'm on your side. Ugh. Ugh. Easy, you They took her. Without Sophia, there's no chance of a cure. We did all we could. But there are forces within Monarch working against you, and I believe Burke was just the tip of the iceberg. It wasn't just Joyce that did this. Uh, sir? Uh, we've recovered Dr. Amaral's laptop. We have it set up over there if you want to take a look. I'll be right there. I want to go over Sophia's figures. If she's right, the fracture is escalating a lot faster than we anticipated. You know the future. Dr. Emerald doesn't. Is the lifeboat even in a viable state for activation? She's trying to convince you the schedule's wrong. Why? To get you to rush this? To make a mistake? The people opposing you. She could be one of them. She isn't. Are you willing to bet the entire plan on that? I implore you, hold off on activation, Paul. Let me clean house before this gets completely out of hand. 
I should have been here. Somebody made a false report. Sent me to the tunnels to divert my attention. Like I said, people working against you. How do you want to proceed? Somebody was working against me. Somebody close. Martin Hatch. Sophia Amaral. I could only trust one of them. Alright, what happens if we trust Amaral? I want him at Bradford. Immediately. So I have some information about Martin Hatch. Martin had been my closest advisor for years. I began to wonder if that had been a mistake. Sophia's loyal. She's always been loyal. I don't think we can trust her. The way she looked at the countermeasure like she's seen it before. She knows what it does. Sophia's research had saved my life. Loyalty doesn't run any deeper. And what happens if we trust Hatch? Evidence was mounting against Sophia. I couldn't simply ignore it, despite everything we had been through. But she knew you'd never make it without those troopers. Then she took them away. If she turned against me with what she knew, the damage could be immeasurable. Hmm. Serene chooses to trust Sophia and suspects Hatch as a traitor, or Serene chooses to trust Hatch and suspects Sophia as a traitor. It's very bare bones, but I'm like, it's Lance. But the question is, how do I feel like Paul would go about this? You know what, because it's Lance, we're gonna trust him. You're right. We need to stick to the original plan. Whether Sophia's date is good or not, we can't deviate from that. Clearly, we have been compromised. Put a team together. Find out who she's been working with. Actually, I've already got something on that front. They just pulled this from the security feed. My God, it's her. Who? Her, Martin. She's one of our employees. How the hell? We got too big for you to screen everybody personally. And we didn't have an idea on her until now. And it is freaking That's out right, right now. <laughs> She's one of our operatives. We've already got a kill team after, but we won't be able to kill her. Not yet. How can she be working with Jack? How does she even know him? I told you, Paul, we can't trust our own people. Who knows how deep this goes? Find out. Beth Wilder. It was the first time I'd heard her name. But she had been there in the past. When it all started. against me from the inside and she wasn't the only one again I am just picking the not so favored choice alrighty I don't know how I'm managing to do that but I'm doing it the treatments they're losing their effectiveness now we get so the show. You shouldn't worry so much. Back up slowly. I need to get in that lab. There's something in there that I need. The lifeboat protocol. Paul's a very dangerous man. And things will only get worse if he continues unchecked. What is it that you're so threatened by, Martin? 
do I look threatened to you? This is Dr. Amaral's report. The stutters, they're, they're increasing in frequency. What is that? A chronon disrupted life form. Extremely hostile. It's Dr. Kim. Stretch. Let's go! Let's go! I feel really good after that stretch now. Wow, okay, that buffer was immediate. You know what? I'll be back. I'm gonna go and grab myself a drink. So, enjoy the be right back screen. So some water. I'm good to go. Hopefully this is though. Uh, retry playing. Okay, that worked out. Being inconspicuous, putting it under his clothes. Nice. Sorry, eyes. Touching eyes is always just like a ugh thing for me. And what did Burke want with it? Well, I don't know. I don't even know what the lifeboat protocol is. It's a sanctuary designed to shelter a list of monarchs' essential personnel to weather the storm until they can develop a solution. Essential personnel. So that means that I'd be on that list, right? Not under Paul Serene's lead, you wouldn't. He's failed to see the value in his own people, too consumed with grand ideals and delusions. Yeah, I never got that cocktail, Weenie. You know what I find to be the most terrifying notion on this planet? 
the idea of God. Simply the idea. A being with that much power, the ability to take and give so freely, that kind of control, but should be feared. Uh, with subtitles? Yep, people believe in it. Just Where did my subtitles go? Why did they? Why did they just stop? <laughs> just as people believe in Paul Saloon. You see, what's so scary about God isn't his control, but rather, if he ever lost it, Paul Sawin's become unhinged, Charlie. He's triggered a catastrophe. He has the chance to fix it, but he's choosing not to. He's choosing to let things end. In the end of time. And this is where we come in. We risk too much leaving the keys to the kingdom in one man's hands. We need insurance. There's something called the CFR. It's a crucial key to our survival and must remain safe. But as long as Paul is the only one with access to it, it isn't. With access to the CFR, I would take over, get Monarch back on track, and once I do, restructuring would be in order, Charlie. Restructuring that would see you as my right hand. I'd be on the list. Absolutely. Then I need to go. Lance, you silk, you, you silky smooth talker. Then I need to go back to Monarch. And that sort of privilege isolation it can only be done from the inside. For the island on lockdown, but the pump house on the west side has an old supply tunnel that runs beneath the bay. No one knows about it. You'll go unseen. Time is of the essence, Charlie. You better get to it. Yeah. Commander Davis. Yes, sir. Head to the perimeter lab. We're moving forward. The frequency of the stutters is still unpredictable, but they're persistent. Erratic, but persistent. I need certainty. If I initiate the protocol, there's no going back. Mr. Serene, something like this. There is no certainty. We've never dealt with it before. How long? We've been running Dr. Amaral's simulations. It's hard to say without her to confirm, but... Just give me a time. The Joyceville could collapse within eight hours. Mr. Serene, if you're going to proceed, now would be the time to decide. <laughs> has no respect for the the windows tablet Charlie Fiona Hey bud where are you going You're right Time's ending just like you said And the lifeboat protocol It's a place they built it to protect people from the fracture. And the only problem is, is, is there's a list and anyone who's not on it is, is pretty much fucked. But if we make it back to the mainland, I, I can get us on the list. 
all of this them. entire island is on lockdown. How are we going to do that, Charlie? There's a tunnel. Hey, all right, if you are lying to me this time, I swear to God. Get off! I'm tired of shit. I don't know why you're doing this, but I don't have to put your name on shit, motherfucker. What'd you do to him? He's fine. I'm gonna tell you why you're gonna put me on that list. I got a pregnant wife at home, and she's the only thing that I am thinking about right now. So if you get in the way of me protecting her, I swear to fucking God, next time, you will not catch your breath. Lead the way. Detail. It's funny. I've come to free you, my friend. This imprisonment. It's unsettling. Time for you to rejoin the others. To return to the infinite. Yeah. Oh man, that was awesome. Your wife. Three months. Congratulations. Punch him in the nose or something. Or just run away. Come on, Charlie, be a good guy. Stick around.
Oh boy. Ah, uh, of course. Let's try this again. That water was taking its time. Are you doing okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm good. We need to get, get on the fucking ground. Hey, ground. No, 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 no. We're with Monarch. What don't you hey. understand? No, get on the ground. Hey, no, no, no. Hey, I'm the one that called it in. I'm Hatch's guy. One guy. Yeah. Who's she? She's a chronon scientist. She's important. We have to get her back to Monarch right away. Please. Get the fuck out of here. Now! Okay, well, <laughs> that escalated. I was expecting a gunshot. I was. I don't know why it still kind of surprised me, though. Yeah. Okay, we're we're really doing this, aren't we? So, anything anybody want to talk about? Anybody got some cool stories? If I had the space, I genuinely would probably download just the episodes at this point because this is getting a bit annoying. I might honestly do that. I'll probably just like delete so much. There we go. Gibson, I got the bird. Fiona! 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 You gotta listen! Hey! Ah. Oh, shit! You killed him! Fuck! Hey! I didn't know that they were gonna kill him. What was I supposed to do? Huh? You let me on and then you kidnapped me. This isn't about you, Charlie! Are you stealing this car? Just get the fuck out of here. No, you're gonna need me. I got what I needed out of you. Yeah, I'm getting used to it. Why don't you open your eyes? The world is about to end. I'm trying to do something. Yeah, you're a real hero. Fuck you. A nurse, huh? I'll see you there. Burke, you fuck. Yo, I'm really gonna enjoy killing your wife. I mean, got what he deserved right there. It's like, I'm gonna kill your wife. Oh, my neck has been slashed. Like that, that, that is just straight up villain nonsense. Like you can't think yourself the good guy when you're like, oh man. I'm looking forward to killing your wife.
Commander Davis. Davis and his team. They're all good men. Monarch's finest. about my treatments? I'm afraid so. You know what this means? You don't know for sure. That... I'm a dead man! Jack. He wants me to become you. He wants me to suffer. Until the end. Joyce and Wilder. But what was troubling me is who got them in the Kim's lab. She paid a visit while she was thought to be missing. She knew where your treatments were kept. She knew the complexities of your illness. And she knew you'd never make it without those treatments. She created them. And then she took them away. I need her found now. And what would you like done with her? I'll decide that when she's brought to me. Lance pulling all of the strings right now. There it goes again. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely downloading this at this point. I don't know what I have to like uninstall for it but this is like i don't even know if there's an episode five i know how the game ends and i don't remember there being an episode five but then again i never watched the oh excuse me the movie like the episodes four I was just telling your girl here how concerned about you we've been. Emily, we need to go. Go? What's the rush?
<laughs> of course. Just buffer, it just, it did enough to get to this point just to be like, Emily, give me the keys. Give me the keys. Get away from me. Get away. Emily, listen to me. No. Listen to me. Please. 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 This is not who I am. This is not. I'm telling you, I never felt good doing this. I, I never, I never felt good doing this. But it's the only thing I knew how to do. And when I got back, I couldn't, I couldn't find anything. I couldn't find anything to do. And Monarch, they found that useful. And they put me to work. I swear to God, I couldn't, I couldn't stand, I couldn't stand being alone. It's, so every Tuesdays and Wednesdays, I would, I would walk down the street because it was the only two nights at the bartender. And she wasn't at school. And I told myself every night to ask you about it. Getting really, really aggravated right now. <laughs> Like, this is extending it to the point where it's, like, this could be done in, like, maybe, like, how much is even left? I don't know, like, what are these, like, 20-some, 30 minutes? This could be done pretty, like, this is gonna take, like, this VOD up to, like, 2 hours and 20 minutes. It took me a fucking How much buffering there is. If Monarch, if they gave me structure, you gave me purpose. I did this to protect you. I did this to protect us, our family. I did this to protect our family. And Emily, you have to listen to me. Something terrible is coming, and I will explain to you on the way, but we have to move. We have to move right now. If you will just let me, if you will just let me protect you one last time, please, please, this is me, it's me, it's me, okay, we have to go, we have to go right now, okay. It's Peters. I'm at the perimeter lab. Sir, I have some information about Martin Hatch. I want him apprehended. Immediately. Oh. Interesting. So even when you choose to trust Hatch, you end up feeling, you end up, be, like, realizing... Wow, the episode's over already? What? <laughs> there felt- it looked like there was so much time left! <laughs> okay. Uh, whatever, it's fine. I- it, it looked like there was so much more time, but I guess not. But yeah, I guess that's, uh, <laughs> that, that's it. <laughs> We're gonna be going on to Act 4. On, uh, on Wednesday, my dudes. Yeah, I feel like that went pretty well gameplay-wise. Like, I don't know, maybe maybe I'm just getting better and better at playing single-player games. That I'm like, yeah, I can get through challenging situations well enough. It also helps with the fact that I have all of the upgrades. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can find the space to download the episodes and just hope that that works instead. Because trying to stream it through 
whatever it is that he's even they're using to stream it is not great. But that's it for me. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll talk to you again on Wednesday for some more. Later.